Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's Crypto Q, just giving you all uh, the uh, 1,000, 10,000K plus review on Davidas and uh, go over a couple of the things that's on the bike here. Um, I was actually just hoping to keep my shadow out of the video. Um, so this is a... Uh, 2019 Vitas brand new uh, model and uh, mold for the year um, it comes with uh, stock Tiagra components uh, not not the top end of the food chain but as you can see um, the bike is is pretty much totally custom except everything that didn't require uh, routing of the cable and apologies for the rusty chain i have a brand new chain this is this is actually an old 11 speed chain um from the trek which is actually aluminum but almost a uh, half a kilo lighter than this carbon bike um and speaking of carbon i don't know if we have this series there um and the light isn't actually so good down there but it has um Vitas uh, 700 series carbon, which is their um, uh, high mod carbon. Um, let's go a run through of the components, the group set really quick. So this is a one piece. Uh, I actually forgot the brand. The cassette is a one recon cassette, recon light, recon lightweight. Um, one piece steel cassette and i'm very impressed uh, the only thing is as you can see i got the derailleur uh pretty much wound wrapped all the way around it which kind of defeats the purpose of having the uh larger jockey wheels uh on top is uh uh f o o s e um ceramic bearing and on the bottom is I believe it's a Luxata from a carbon cage all on the uh, RX derailleur with I have the clutch turned off because as you can see as I said it's pretty wrapped around um, up front is um, a 105 53 36 which is not at all the Tiagra it came with um, which was accidentally uh, totally discarded by the way um, so as you can see, Ultegra 6800, 170 cranks with uh, 105, 39 tooth and a Tiagra front derailleur, uh, pretty mixed Shimano group set um, with the exception of the, uh, the recon cassette in the back and the look carbon uh, blade uh, chromo pedals uh, those pedals are super tight my ankles are are really bad really trash from military service uh slowing everything down stock trp spire calipers with uh 140 shimano uh with one 140 shimano rotors because this was really i was kind of uh, upset that the bike wasn't lighter than it was so i just pretty much threw all the parts that were lying around on it uh to, to just make it as light as possible um 150 kcnc arrow 2 stem it's uh really long and i thought it was going to be too low but this is actually really comfortable um holding uh, 46 or, or 460 millimeter Easton bars from competitive cyclists shout out to competitive cyclists got a, a pretty good relationship with them over there um, the nog lights uh, for a little bit of safety that doesn't look really bright right now but uh, for people who can barely drive cars it, it seems to get their attention um, uh, Alpha Pasca seat post pretty just basic um, unbranded actually carbon stuff holding uh, the Shimano Pro stealth saddle on top this is the um, the carbon 
carbon composite version. It's not the full carbon, uh, but the one. 155 I think is is the width on this this is super comfortable uh, the the cutout is not just to save weight it's super comfortable and as you can see I took the liberty of uh, go ahead and I can't remember what this angle is it is really extreme it might be uh, 10 degrees plus actually and uh, that's it not nothing else but the the, the one thousand K mark on this bike actually came and went and I realized I never did a review so the the thing with this bike is this geometry and the, the frame design on this bike is really this it's super fast even even before I started dropping the pounds getting clipped into this bike and, and and kicking and pulling those pedals up you can feel the bike almost just lift up off the ground and actually the the other reason for the 140 swap versus the 160 wasn't just to save weight it was to um the 160 brakes on this thing especially when it was brand new um would almost throw me over the handlebars that's how grippy and and solid the stock trp brakes are on this um shout out to to vitas uh or vitas or however you pronounce it uh some people even go as far as to pronounce it vitas but it's french of course manufactured in uh in an asian country this one particularly uh cambodia you know it's it's a global product it's got italian uh vittoria uh Zaffirino. Uh, I'm sorry, Zafirio, uh rubber 28s on it, and they're actually really low on pressure. And um, I also just realized I didn't talk about the wheels because the wheels aren't stock. Um, the wheels are surprisingly, I found out by surprise. Um, uh, I went on an Alibaba site and for some of you who don't know there's not just one Alibaba site there are there's actually a couple of different ones <clears throat> so excuse me as far as uh, cultivating a relationship with our, our friends over in the east I went on an Alibaba site which I, I, I know I get really good deals on <clears throat> and I found these wheels which were plain uh, they met all of my all of the requirements of course with the uh the the one piece rotors versus the the floating six bolt rotors um <clears throat> i think they charged like an extra 22 dollars the the wheel set all together was was still under 400 dollars so those are uh 30 mil uh and i i honestly thought i was buying unbranded wheels and uh during the transaction when i was being rung up the uh customer service person said do you want carbon speed cycle logos and i was like oh wow so not only am i getting a deal on an alibaba site but as it turns out i'm actually buying directly from carbon speed cycle which i mean they sell directly but just just that level of customer service just on on an alibaba site a lot of people are really quick to uh to talk down on ebay and alibaba and trust me i ride this bike uh city city biking and those wheels are absolutely bomb proof they it, almost i want to check them almost every time after i ride but the, you know the, the decals of course are delicate but these wheels are absolutely bomb proof potholes 90 degree uh curbs the whole nine yards and and no puncture and th those are the uh original tires that came with the uh shimano uh rs wheel set that came with the bike which was super light and uh tubeless ready out of the box so for i think i got this one for 9 20 just just under a grand which unfortunately that's the the intro that's the intro uh price 
into this market is somewhere between uh, seven and a thousand. And as you see it, um, as I said, good relationship with competitive cyclists, um, uh, developing uh, relationships, and, and I, I buy and resell high-end bike parts. So these companies out there are working with, with entrepreneurs. And in this global space, in this global economy, it's, it's even out there for the little guy. You know, if they move your cheese, you got to find out where that new cheese is. This is uh, an old uh, control tech uh, top cap that I use. I just, I wanted to keep kind of a theme. Red, white, and blue is also French. Uh, Vitas is a French brand, I'm pretty sure. I didn't give you the, the actual name of the bike or <laughs> the backstory on the brand, but yeah, Vitas is French. Um, give a check out over at uh, Chain Reaction Cycles and Wiggle. Shout out to Wiggle. Wiggle um, gives a lot of free stuff. It's it's Wiggle isn't um, the Rafa Cycling Club, but uh, they do a good job of of rewarding their customers with uh, with the brands. I think I'll, I'll drop down uh, my links in the description for this video. Crypto Q, thanks for checking it out. Uh, 1,000 miles. You can check it out on Strava. Sometimes I, I share it on Instagram and Twitter. My rise, my progress, my health, my lifestyle. Peace.